What is up YouTube, Duncan Beaumont here with Hypedrepreneur TV and in this video we are starting off a brand new series called Resellers Weekly. Basically the way this series is going to work is every Sunday I'll be dropping a new video detailing what we'll be dropping in the upcoming week, telling you what's profitable, giving you some resell predictions and telling you how to cop as well. Again, I'm going to be doing this every Sunday. So if you always want to be alert of what we'll be dropping, whether it's a low key cook or a super hyped up sneaker, make sure you hit that subscribe button and turn post notifications on as well so that you can be well informed and know what will be dropping and what will be profitable at any given time. So this week we definitely have a ton of super profitable items releasing. We've also got some really good low key cooks. So definitely make sure you stick around for the whole video. But before we do start off, I have one quick announcement. This morning, I was able to successfully cop a pair of 10 and a half Jordan 1 Light Smokes, and I do plan on giving those away. It will be a little bit different giveaway format than the ones I have done in the past. So if you guys aren't subscribed, if you're not following my Instagram, make sure you do that right now. Instagram will be linked below because I'm going to have more information very soon on this giveaway. Again, Jordan 1 Light Smoke, size 10 and a half. The giveaway will start in about a week and it's going to last about two weeks. So definitely make sure you stay tuned for that. So to start off the week on Monday, we have a fairly low key sneaker but it's actually pretty profitable. And this is a New Balance Bodega collab called the All Terrain. Personally, I think it's pretty ugly, but right now, resale is around $300, especially in those bigger sizes. And retail is only $140, so there's definitely a lot of room for profit on these shoes. Now, they already released on Bodega's website, which means this New Balance release will not hurt the resale as much. It will definitely go down a little bit, but it's not going to be too drastic. But anyways, on Monday, like I said, they will be releasing on New Balance's website. Personally, I think it'll be a midnight drop, probably Sunday night into Monday. Midnight is when they will drop. But it also could be 10 a.m. Eastern time on Monday, so just be prepared for both of those times. The most important tip to copying on New Balance is to make sure you have click and buy enabled. If you don't know what this is, basically just make sure you're signed into your New Balance account. Go to the settings and you'll see click and buy. Make sure you have that turned on. And the way this works is that as soon as those shoes drop, you'll just hit your size and then hit click and buy and it will check out for you. Don't test this on other shoes though because it will work. It will just trust that it will work because if you test it on another shoe, if you test the click and buy, then you're actually going to buy it. Now again, I think these will be very profitable, especially in bigger sizes, but even if they brick, even if there's no profit, New Balance has free returns, so there's no risk. So I definitely recommend trying to cop these shoes. Okay, so Tuesday, Wednesday of this week are a little slow, but on Thursday, we've got some very profitable items dropping. Unfortunately, the Supreme season is done, but don't worry, it will be back with fall, winter, and towards the end of August, maybe early September. But anyways, even though we don't have Supreme, there is definitely still some profitable items releasing this Thursday. We're going to be getting a couple new colorways of the Space Hippie Collection, specifically the 01, 02, and 03 models, which if you don't know, those are the most profitable models. These will be releasing on Nike sneakers at 10 a.m. Eastern, and all three of the models I talked about will be profitable. The original collection did very well. Even though I don't think this collection will do quite as well resale-wise, I don't think the colorways are quite as hyped, I do think they will resell pretty well. And again, even if they brick, Nike sneakers has free returns, free cancels, so there's no risk again. Also, if you guys don't know, Larger sizes do much better in the Space Hippie collection, so just remember that when you're picking which size you want to go for. There's also a new Jordan 11 low colorway releasing, but it's not going to resell, so don't cop those unless you plan on rocking them. So now Friday is when we have quite a few profitable items releasing, especially some low-key cooks, so definitely guys, Friday is going to be a big day. To start off, we have the highly anticipated Air Force One Drew Leagues releasing. These will retail for $110 and will be releasing on Nike sneakers. Personally, I could see resale being around $155, maybe even a little more in bigger sizes. So you guys are making at least like $30 to $40 profit. And since retail is low, only $110, you might be able to cop two or three pairs. So definitely, I think they'll be pretty profitable. So try to cop as many pairs as you can of these Drew League Air Force Ones. There's also a potential Essentials drop. 
Now, if you guys don't know, Essentials does drop some pretty profitable items. Specifically, the shorts are what I'm thinking of, and they will be releasing on this drop. Now, I'm not sure if it will be this Friday. It's not confirmed, but there is a good chance. So definitely stay tuned because I'll have more information on when they will be dropping and what will be profitable. But again, this release will definitely have some profitable items, guys. Now, finally on Friday, another low-key cook that we will see is the Eric Emanuel shorts. Now, he hasn't officially announced which colorway he will be releasing this Friday, but personally, I think it'll be this blue colorway. And if it is, if I'm right, then these should be pretty profitable. Retail is stupid high for shorts, 108 bucks, but resale is pretty high too, around 160, maybe a little more if you can sell immediately after the drop. Sizes medium and large should do the best, but even small and extra large should do pretty good resale wise as well. If you guys aren't into reselling Eric Emanuel yet, you got to get into it because they drop every Friday and they usually have profitable items. Also, it should be a lot easier to cop manually because he's been adding a question to stop bots from taking all the stock pretty much. Okay, so those are the items releasing this week. Again, a lot of profitable low-key items, so I definitely recommend going for all of those. That low-key profit really does add up, guys. I would say that's where I make most of my money. So if you aren't into that low-key resale game yet, make sure you get into that ASAP. Also, a lot could change throughout the week, whether it's release dates, resale, retails, whatever. So make sure you're subscribed to the channel and following my Instagram because I'll have updates on everything dropping and also some more in-depth how to cop guides as well. Finally, one last reminder about that giveaway. I will be giving away a pair of 10 and a half Jordan 1 Smoke Grays. So if you guys are interested in that, make sure you're subscribed to the channel and following my Instagram. I'll be doing this every week, guys. So if you want to know what will be dropping, what's going to be profitable so you can resell every profitable item, just make sure you hit that subscribe button again. But anyways, guys, that is the video. Good luck copying this week. Thanks for watching. And until next time, peace out.